Hello, my name is Kaj Dhatture. Today I am giving uh, open elective electrical technology IEC1 activity of diagram presentation. My, uh, my roll number is 57. Uh, my topic is the construction of DC motor. As you can see in the diagram, there the DC motor consists of mainly part is shaft around itself. The armature copper coil winding is a uh, rounded attached permanently to the shaft. Uh, the permanent magnet pole core or pole shoes uh, is uh, rounded by permanent magnet is attached to the body itself for, for DC motor. This whole structure is uh, uh, is uh, situated on the base. Uh, the mainly part content is armature conductor, uh, pull core, uh, field coil, uh, permanent magnets, shaft, and base. So this is the construction uh, diagram of the DC motor. Uh, let's uh, uh, take deep information about the construction of DC motor. The con mainly construction, the main work of the DC motor is the convert uh, electrical energy to mechanical motion. Uh, several key components uh, is a stator uh, permanent magnet, electromagnet generates a static field uh, within the motor. Uh, often comparing a coil of wire armature is positioned uh, within the stator can rotate freely. When a direct current uh, DC is applied to the armature, it uh, induces a magnetic field interacting with the stator's field, resulting in the generation of a rotate rotational force commutators the brushes are essential for maintaining electrical contact with the armature ensuring that the direction of current flow through the armature coil changes a reversal of current direction in the coil creates continuous rotation that indispensable is a various application from small appliances to industrial machineries uh, like you can uh, see that the the current is passed through the armature coils uh, that uh, results in magnetic uh, motions uh, and the uh, permanent magnet is also have magnetic motions um, they both uh, get repelled and the uh, dc motor uh, works there uh, the mainly components uh, used in the construction of dc motors are stator rotor commutator brushes uh, let's see about stator stator is a stationary part uh, consists of a permanent magnet or electromagnet it provides static magnetic field that interacts with the rotor uh, rotor or it co also called armature the armature is, a, armature is a rotating part of motor often made up of coil of wire when a current flows through the armature it generates a magnetic field that interacts with the stator's field causing the motor to rotate commutator is a split ring connected to the armature shaft it reverses the direction of current flow in the armature coil when it rotates uh, ensuring continuous rotation Brushes is a very important part. It uh, con it it uh, contact with the commutator, allowing the electrical current to flow into the armature as it rotates. It is uh, continuously in contact with the armature as it rotates. The, uh, it passes the current to the armature. Uh, this is the main component, uh, main key components in the construction of uh, DC motors. So this is the all uh, about DC motor is a fundamental components like stator, rotor, commutator, or brushes. This is simple effective design to allow conversion of electrical energy to mechanical energy. DC motors are widely employed across a spectrum of applications ranging from small household applications to heavy duty industrial machineries. Due to their efficiency, reliability and adaptability as technology continues in advance, these motors are likely to see greater utilization improvements in performance contributing to various industries and our daily lives. So this is all about the uh, uh, this is all about the construction of DC or uh, DC motor. So this is the conclusion, and uh, thank you, thank you very much. This is the IC1 activity of my thank you.